Hi, my name is Joanna. This is my husband, Carlos. Hi. We are from Puerto Rico. Our son, Carlos Julian, is three years old. Um, three years and a month. Carlos' history began when he was around one year and nine months old. When we started um, noticing um, some changes in his behavior, specifically he had um, poor eye contact, um, he was very aggressive, um, he hit me all the time, he pulled his sister's hair, um, he was very impulsive, he constantly threw things around the house, he was very difficult to control even difficult to go out with him to the supermarket or whatever. So um, he was not understanding the, any instruction that we are giving to him. He wasn't understanding everything. Um, no commands he followed. Um, his his language stopped developing. Um, he just said like ten words when he was almost two years. Um, so. Um, back in Puerto Rico, where we live, um, we started, you know, going to the professionals. We thought they knew how to deal with autism and autism spectrum disorders. Um, we really didn't know what to do, um, so we took him to psychiatrist, psychologist, neuro neurodevelopmental specialist. Um, we did. We started by doing the therapies, speech therapy, behavior therapy, occupational therapy. And he started to respond slowly. He started to improve his eye contact um, <coughs> after the diet, um, the gluten-free, casein-free diet, he started to understand. But really, the turning point in Carlos Julian um, Improvement w was when we got him into treatment with Dr. Newbrander. We um, found out about Dr. Newbrander through a conference, autism conference in Orlando. We really like his approach um, to autism, this biomedical approach to autism. And we scheduled an appointment with Dr. Newbrander in February. Um, we started the Methyl B12 shots on March. Um, 2007. Three weeks, around three weeks after our first appointment, we started the first shot. It was 2007, 2008. 2007. No. 2008. 2008. So, um, after the first week in the methyl B12 shot, um, Carlos, before the methyl B12 shot, Carlos Julian, he was um, saying words, he was saying, he had a vocabulary of 100 words, but he wasn't putting words together. He just communicated like that. Um, I like, I like signal things. And um, after a week in the Method B12, um, he started to um, communicate more. His speech started to develop again. He started to um, do logical thinking, um, um, improving his um, weight of communication with the therapist. His hyperactivity behavior calmed down. You. Um, we're able to sit down with him and watch a movie or watch a video without he coming here and there. Um, he started to take in more advantage of his um, therapies because he could stay still longer. He could focus more. He could concentrate more. He could understand more. And he could understand you more. Um, he started following more complex commands. Um, he started to imitate more. Um, he just loved, for example, um, Lazy Town um, in the Scrubby Kids. And he's like, Mommy, Mommy, me, T Town, T Town. That's the way he says Lazy Town. And he just started doing things like Spartacus, the superhero does. Um, 
and it was great. He started um, to socialize more with his sister in more appropriate way, more age appropriate um, for him without hitting her or without um, doing any tantrum. So um, all, all, all this time, his language just kept improving. Three words together, um, four words together, um, just in three uh, three months period. Um, after three months, he was such a great responder. We started the everyday protocol method B12 shots. He kept on improving. Um, Dr. Newbrander recommended the HBAT um, chamber protocol 90 hours. So we came um, this this summer. We did the 90 hours protocol. And um, at the beginning, I didn't see any changes after one week. After the method B12, it was so great. We saw, you know, re, uh, the response just like in a week, seven days period. So we were kind of expecting the results sooner, but um, I was a little bit of spectacle. But after two weeks ago, he really started talking, talking and talking and repeating, and in spontaneous speech just came um, very, very quickly, saying, I love you, saying, Mom, look, um, white truck. Every time we go, we pass by a truck in the highway. Um, he even um, learned um, words without me even taught him even English words. He's been, you know, um, learning since we are here. His main language is Spanish, so I guess he's more sharp, he's more in there. Um, he's asking questions, what, where, when. Um, he's just been um, great with the age, but at, at the beginning a little bit hyperactive, but um, that seemed to be now a way the hyperactivity, and he's just talking, talking, talking constantly, repeating, um, imitating. He is talking what he can talk and we, what he cannot talk. And you can see him that he just trying to think the words in his mind and then um, trying to communicate um, his communicative speech, his conversational speech is better. So I think um, it's hard, it's a lot of work. Um, the HBOT, the method B12, um, the supplements, the, um, the, the, the neurofeedback also. The neurofeedback also, um, it's hard work, but it's... And the, and the gastrointestinal scene. And the, his GI issues, but um, it's all worth it um, at the end. There's a hope. There's hope. There's hope for us, and we hope that with our example, um, my child um, gives you hope to all the parents that are seeking a miracle. So this is a miracle for us.
¿Cuánto quieres ver? ¿Cómo estás buscando? Mira, Carlos, coge el carro y ponlo aquí. Mira el carrito. No. ¿No? ¿Qué tú ah, quieres mira, hacer? Mira, esta. Esta, mira. Mira, aquí está el de la vaca. Ve y búscalo, ve. No. Mira, ¿dónde están los cruz? Busca los cruz y de la vaca, vete. No, no. ¡Wow, Elmo! ¡Wow, qué fíjate! Vente. ¡Wow! Mami, la vaca. 